at four. Welcome back this half hour. A silver lining of sorts, born really out of the pandemic. The need for more self-expression and a way to preserve history. It came from a time of isolation. WPTV News Channel 5's Tori Dunnan reports today. Seniors in Boca Raton are taking a class learning how to document their memoirs. Going back to my wedding when I was 20 years old. My life, my way, writing your life story. Right from your heart. It's a simple concept. It's a wonderful thing. Filled with heartbreak. She looked around and said, I have many good friends here. And humor. I also remember her saying, picking out a, a grave site for my father, it's good to be near rich people. Gil Schwartz lives at the Sinai Residences in Boca Raton, a senior living community. She's in a new class all about preserving the past through your own story. Who I was and where I came from. Why do you think writing this memoir is important? I would like my children and grandchildren to remember me and this would be something not just what they've seen or heard but something in a tangible form. Her story is one of a school teacher, a wife, mother, and grandmother, a law student in her 40s. What do you hope they remember most in giving them this memoir? I want them to remember me as a happy person who accomplished much more than I ever hoped to accomplish, and that knowing that there was still more good things to come, even at this age. The course idea stemming from the past 18 months. I know that I was always taunted by my siblings as the favorite child. I'm happy about that now. The pandemic presenting power in the written word. One of the results of being in isolation was the need to express themselves creatively, the residents to express themselves in different ways. That's where poetry, stories, and memoirs, just the idea of the written word, were born from. It was heartbreaking to me and made me smile at the same time, thinking back on my life. A gift for these seniors' families and for themselves. The hope is that these written memoirs then turn into monologues, a piece of history kept forever. In Boca Raton, Tori Dunnan, WPTV News Channel 5.